Welcome back for another episode of CK3 as we take on the Pope once more. This time, we're gonna win this war. We will destroy them, and we have enough troops that we should be able to do this. 0.1 per day. Oh man, that's gonna take fucking forever. 0.11. Man alive, even if we assault the fort, it's not gonna matter. It's still gonna take ages just to take this down. Okay, that's fine. We have three family members, just another grandson that I don't care about, and I'm not calling any of my allies into this war. Oh god, this is gonna take fucking forever just to get this. Defender of Faith, thank you. We just gained a good amount of diplomacy. 278. And he's he still at war with one of my vassals? No, it's only me now. He can go wherever he wants right now at this point. I just need to get these three provinces and then we're done. And that's kind of how I'm going to treat this. No effect during the siege. No effect. God damn it. Stalemate. Fuck it, bitch. Stalemates need to end, man. We've gotten it up to over half. I mean, we can call our allies to war, but I don't see a reason to, to be honest. It's not worth my time. We just need, once we've taken Rome, we can go for the other one pretty quickly. Okay, let's see what the war score is once we get this. Because it really is just taking Rome. Man alive, this is going to take forever. Nine hundred thirty. All right, let's see what we get for the war score. Cause he can't take our whole country, so I'm not too concerned to be honest. Yep, sure. Oh man, that took fucking everything to get it. You want to go there? You want to go down there, man? We'll chase your ass down. I don't care. I will kill you. That's fine. Don't think for a second I'm even in the slightly bothered by you. No. Nope, 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 nope. That's not happening now. No matter how long that would take, I'm not letting you do that. Yeah, you need to be wiped out. Goodbye. Okay, we need to take the other side. I can take a concubine. Sure, why not? Uh, yeah, sure, that's fine. Oh man, even at 1.4, we're still gonna take forever to get this. Although he'll come down here and he'll try to siege the papacy back, which is fine by me, because he won't get any effects. As long as we outbeat him, we can destroy him. And this will make it so he can't raise any more troops. 321. Yeah, we're double his siege score. And he's got 300 on top of what we have to deal with. So we just got to beat the Pope. Once he's unlanded, we're perfectly fine. <laughs> it is my last duty as Basilis Philanthios I of Italia. The Empire of Italia. We will gain this 500 that's an okay let the that's fine that's 549 jesus he's at 603 i mean we're 200 away what is he is he getting effects what the fuck oh does he have he has a different one than i do let's get theologian i mean we're still gonna beat him but god that's annoying how close he got friend of mine died, and there's the war. <sighs> Thank you, alive. Let's also then go raid the papacy. Alright, we're gonna make Roma our capital. 
yes. Because that's a lot of money for us. Now, are these all held? Yes. Oh, well, they dismissed, but that's fine. And we're not going to win this, so. Yep, that's fine. Damn, they kicked our ass out. Now, he should have less money he's making. He still makes 35 a month. Fucking Christ. But he already called a crusade, so I don't have to care anymore. Yeah, whatever. We're disbanding the army. Oh, I don't care about imprisonment. Man alive. We have done so much now. Okay. You need to come over here and convert the culture. I also need you to come here and fix this. And then what? Yeah, sure. I'll spend the 50 gold. That's fine. Oh, man. We've almost dismantled the papacy. Can we make any decisions based on, like, the Pope's lands now? Or... or Reforming the Roman Empire? No. I guess not. I guess we have to get Rome itself. Um, let's assign you. So we have no decision to make the Roman Empire. Can I look up that title? Uh, let's try Empire of Rome. No? Is there no... I know there's Italia. But... Huh. Okay, cool. Well, whatever. Whew. Either way. Oh, man. It's nice having this for a holy site. Because <laughs> now, because we have this, we gain 10% growth and plus one stewardship. Oh, feels good. And we'll be converting it immediately. What's going on? Oh, they want my va nephew as despot. Who wants? Oh, he wants me. Makes sense. Let's sway him. No pro point in letting him be. Alright, we're going to be dead within the year. So, first thing I'm going to do. To avoid... Nope. Uh, nope. Let's go to him as a character. We're going to imprison him. Use hook. Nope, because we're going to do the same to you in a minute. Imprison, use hook. Got it. Got it. Both of you are going to be... Uh, if I disinherit you, how much does it cost? 150 and 300 prestige. Yep. Which means I am now going to negotiate your release and banish you. Same with your brother. We can blackmail you. Interesting. Alright, we've gained a hook on him again. Um, disinherit. And we're going to then negotiate your release, and we're just going to banish you. There you go. Now you still have claims to inherit. So we're going to do the same thing with you. Actually, I can just disinherit you, right? Which means you gain nothing. All right. And our youngest is a daughter, so I don't even care. Farewell. Goodbye, kid. Um, They'll pray to our gods. I agree. Yeah, I'll create this duchy. Thank you. We have too many held duchies. So we hold Apulia and Venice and Latium. Well, they all make 
me money, but I guess to Puglia I could grant to this person. You will be granted the title of Apulia. There you go. But I'm keeping that one piece of land. Congrats. <laughs> He's the old one of the oldest houses I founded, but you know what? Congrats to him. Okay. We did have to disinherit, so. Uh, nope, I'll let this slide. We don't have a reason to go after you. Not in the slightest. Oh man, alive. We have built up so much. Uh, yep. Yeah, not one day too soon. Someone died. That's fine. Our steward needs to be reassigned. Great. All Hellenic, right? Yep. Perfect. Um, nope. Oh, man. Really? You're gonna be like that? Alright, raise our troops. New learning perk? Sure. And we're just gonna wipe this poor guy, this poor rebel out. He's not gonna know what hit him. Yep, there it is. And then, well, we can actually set them all to go and burn him down. We will ransom you. Yep, you're gonna try, Pope. Thanks. <gasps> no! 11 minutes in. Alright, Basilis Valanthius, the first of Italia, has crossed the River Styx. He 81 years of age. He died of unknown causes. Known to be a respected scholar, he spent most of his days studying in his library, rarely leaving his castle. We fought a 17 offensive wars, 18 defensive. We were gallant, we had whole body, and we were a theologian. We were a religious icon, we were a legendary icon, and we were dreaded as well as we died at the age of 81. See you on the next episode, guys.